This video is going to take us all out of our comfort zone, guys. The title does not lie. People live in this cemetery. There's houses here. Manila North Cemetery. The journey starts now. Please like and subscribe and enjoy the video. So we're a couple hundred meters away from the entrance point. We're coming along to a roundabout here where we get to choose a few different directions. We got told pretty strictly at the entrance point not to film in here. So what we've done is obviously we're going to film, right? So we're taking the actual extension off the GoPro, we've just got the little cube. She's holding it above her coffee real casually. So we're going to get into the heart of it and we're going to show you what it's all about. But just wanted to update you guys, filming is not allowed in these premises, which totally makes sense. It's a cemetery, for God's sakes. Check out the kids here having a play in the graveyard. It was a public holiday today. I hope they got permission from their parents because that's pretty wild stuff. It's not so creepy in here, guys. You're probably thinking, like, is this place giving me the creeps? Not necessarily. It's also bright daylight. If we were going around with a spotlight at night time, it'd be pretty creepy. But, yeah, these these graveyards, that's the amount of money. you got to literally get builders out here to build your grave. Hey, you too. Yes. Hey, brother. <laughs> Looks like you got a friggin' tombstone on the side of his bike. See that stuff? Hey bro. It's for the for the what? Great. For the army. Military graveyard here guys. Here's the police. Graveyard. Rest in peace. Looking at some proper houses now, guys. Like, not even fenced areas, but fully enclosed buildings. Considering this is an area for deceased people, everyone's surprisingly friendly. Gives you a good idea of the Philippines. Even in the graveyards, you still find a way to be happy. Man, what's up? Hey, hey my friend, where are you from? Australian, where are you from? From Philippines. Philippines. I, I, I live here in the Philippines and I live here in cemetery. Nice man, I'm Adam. Yeah, nice to meet you, it's Mr. Me. Adam. Do you have a YouTube? Yes. You do. My YouTube channel is Young Berlon. Okay, we'll have to. I'll write it down. Uh, if I write down mine, you can write down yours. Yes. Yeah, sure. Sounds and good. I have a Facebook page. Okay, cool, I man. I'm a police officer here in the Philippines. Oh, you're a police officer? Yes, I am. Oh, a I we just passed the police officer yes, sir, cemetery. Yes, sir, yes. So, do you know people there? Yes. That, yes. that are buried oh, there? Yes, yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh man, good to meet you. I'm Adam. Nice to meet you, sir. Cool, bro. So guys, just got the dude's YouTube. He's a police officer, as he said. Local here in Manila. And he actually knows people, as you guys heard, that are buried back in that police cemetery. So pretty wild stuff. Got his account, shouted my account out in his YouTube. We're chilling. Yo, yo. What's up, man? Check this out guys, little pyramid structure. This is how I want to be buried. Now we're talking some serious legendary status. Shout out to the Eye of Horus. Egyptians knew what they were on about. So as we do when we journey guys, it's great to go down sub paths and side lanes and stuff like that. Look at that map, gross. But we're literally in a cemetery, so we're pretty restricted. Um, from a moral perspective and also probably a law perspective from where we can go so we're gonna have to be a lot more careful I can't just go zipping down random lanes and looking at other people's cemetery we need to actually stay on the road and just observe from the road hello no. uh, that's pretty much the only option we have which we're cool with but all I'm saying I can't just go dot down there and freaking trample on concrete and look for a cool thing we uh got to be a bit respectful here, guys. We're going to pass by the graveyard so that we can go to the park. Yeah. Just check out some of the rubbish and stuff. It's just such a big cemetery. How can you expect a little group of people to keep the whole place tidy? So James just asked for directions and she literally got pointed in that direction. So we might have to take a shortcut 
through these blocks. How crazy is that? Chickens just hanging in the cemetery. He's all tied up. Hey, buddy. Dancing with the devil if you're vandalizing a grave. Maybe it's not vandalism, maybe they're love messages or whatever. All right, we're literally going down the sub pass because we got directed down here, which kind of writes off what I said before. I'm just following Jane, guys. Don't have a go at me for walking on people's graves. What the hell are we doing? Oh my God. Is this going to get removed off YouTube? Say some prayers while you're on there. are not the only one doing it, that's for sure. Oh my God. Check that out, guys. Someone's house in a graveyard. This is wild. Are you praying, Jane? No, I'm saying excuse me. I'm just in by. Yeah. Jane just saying excuse me. This is wild, man. I never would have thought we'd be passing through. This is one of the most hectic shortcuts I've ever taken. Holy crap, guys. Hey bro, what's up? Hey guys. You just give them. Huh? Yeah, give them some money? Mm -hmm. Just giving them a bit of money, guys. Just got 50 pesos here, guys, to show respect and pass through these people's property. Yeah. Thank you. It's okay, bro, it's okay. Thank you, bro. It's okay. It's okay, bro. <laughs> Little puppy here, guys. Probably got born in the cemetery. Hey, guys. Lee, could you give them coins for you on a paper? Sun is beaming. I'm just going for a little walk, Jack. Come through, bro. The cemetery where people live. Got 10 pesos, give it that. So we're giving 10 pesos. She only asked for four, but. Just grab my coffee. Thank you. Thank you. One sec, Dan. Yeah, all good. Okay, guys. Do not want to drop my GoPro down there. I think I'm probably the heaviest dude that's ever gone down these stairs. Just over 100 kilos at the moment. Thank you. These are houses. <laughs> we made it out. There's a main road down there, guys. We still are in the cemetery. But how about that? Literally mentioning how we weren't going to go down any side tracks. False information. Oh, car was racing that whole time. I guess your adrenaline going when you're in completely uncomfortable and foreign areas, especially like that. It is wild. We are heading out of the cemetery. Absolutely wild, that tour. 
I'm, I'm lost for words, really. You guys can just watch the footage back and just see how wild it is. People living in those areas, you know, in, 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 Western, in Western society, we complain we don't have air conditioning or refrigeration. Meanwhile, there's people living in areas like this. Completely crazy. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one.